Hi, I'm Paul. Hi, I'm poor. How's it going, everyone? Uh, speaking of what we're about to watch, and um, I hope all of you and your families are staying healthy and safe out here and all of this craziness. So this is recommended to me by Kid Rich on my Discord. <laughs> but this is a Johnny Ethco animation, so uh, I'm looking forward to this. So this is life after pretty much the virus. We're going to check out what this animation may be. I'm assuming there's going to be a crazy ass twist and turn on this somehow, some way. Before we begin, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell to be notified whenever I post and give this video a huge thumbs up. Okay, so this is before. Hey, Grandpa, what were things like before the virus? Oh, kids, you don't want to hear the ramblings of an old fool. Come on, tell us, Grandpa. <laughs> so. <laughs> All right. What the fuck? <laughs> Who gave that kid some crack? Because that's exactly what he got. I'm assuming this is like in the future, obviously. Uh, like maybe, I don't know, 10 years from now or something crazy like that. Who knows? All right, calm down. Months ago, before the virus, Life was very different. Nobody wore these silly masks, and we all went out to magical places called shopping centers. Mm. Pretty much. What, what, what's a shopping center, Grandpa? Shopping <laughs> Grandpa! <laughs> oh my shit. Oh. But yeah, unfortunately, online shopping is probably going to have to be the new norm, but we don't know. Pro elaborate buildings full of useless crap. We would go into these places and purchase this crap in order to make us feel better about ourselves. Did it work? Not at all, my child. The items we bought would briefly make us feel better, but in the harsh, cold reality that the world is completely out of our control, we would slowly slip back in, leading us to seek other forms of dopamine drips. What's a dopamine? No, 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 what's a dopamine? Dopamine <laughs> is a chemical released by our brain that makes us briefly feel good. Have you kids ever had an orgasm? Oh, yeah. When you. Oh, what? That's not even morally correct. You got your own grandpa. You're not even old enough to. And first of all, what that little kid just said. Have you kids ever had an orgasm? Oh, yeah. When you have an orgasm. <laughs> He said, oh yeah. Orgasm, your brain receives a giant dose of dopamine. However, your brain also gets tiny bursts of it when you buy something, or play a fun video game, or watch one of those terrible internet cartoons. What the fuck? We also went out to places called restaurants. Restaurants? It was a building where you could order food, and instead of it being delivered to your house, they would bring it to a, a table you sat at. Wow. What, what else did you do? Grandpa? We used to go to these places called movie theaters. It was a building where you could gather with a bunch of people and watch a film. Whoa, that sounds awesome. Oh, far from it, my child. These places had the latest movies, but they were bastions of inconveniences. Tickets to see the film were expensive, but they were only the initial cost. The snacks are where they really stuck. Mm -hmm. Six dollars for a pack of gummy bears. <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> and then, after paying an arm and a leg for a seat, they made you sit through 15 to 20 minutes of advertisements. Oh after yeah. Paying them all that money, they still put ads in front of you? Yes. <laughs> Then while you were trying to watch the film, you would be constantly distracted. People behind you talking. A man to your left, crunching on his overpriced popcorn. So fucking annoying, man. A moron, three rows in front of you, checking their phone. A child. Oh, why is this child? A child. <laughs> I want to pick up that child. I want to squeeze his neck. And I want to kick him like a football. <laughs> And then the worst thing is that after enduring the price, the ads, the people, the distractions, the noise, the worst thing is at the end of Oh, he, he, he getting deep as fuck on this. Absolute garbage. What the fuck is that kid's mouth? <coughs> oh god, Grandpa, that sounds awful. It was. My hope is, if we fully recover from this madness, maybe movie theaters. That's the one thing we all agree to let die. 
and GameStop. Fuck GameStop. Fuck GameStop, honestly. Well, all right. That was uh, very accurate. But as I said, yeah, fuck GameStop, you know? I mean, unless you work at GameStop, excuse me. I mean, I've loved GameStop in the past, but man, they have really just turned greedy, you know? Anyways, that's not the point, okay? <laughs> that kid needs some help. That grandpa, you know, he... he, he you know, he, he had all his life to go through things, so he has a right to bicker and stuff. And I feel for the little girl. But the big crazy damn thing about this, why the fuck did he think it was correct to ask some kids? You have a bust a nut, <laughs> pretty much. Anyways, let me know how you felt about the video down below. Give me some other videos to react to as well. Check out all the links in the description. Be sure to follow me on Twitch. Join the Discord server. Thank you guys for joining me. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell to be notified whenever I post. Give this video a huge thumbs up. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. It's been DJB. Peace out.